This is part two of three on my ideas surrounding a key ingredient of business success, resilience. Every day in business, we get knocked down. Prospects hang up on us. The bank cancels our line of credit. People don't show up for meetings or demos. Deals get delayed for no apparent reason. Any of these sound familiar? To add to this, people are spending more time alone, virtual offices, Zoom meetings, and only communicating with customers over the phone. All of this can have a negative effect on our resilience. So what is resilience? Well, to me, resilience is having the mental fortitude to get knocked down seven times and get up eight. It's recognizing the reality of our situation, whatever it is, and pushing ahead. It's knowing there will always be obstacles, no denial, but making and implementing a plan to get through or around those obstacles. Having resilience is knowing we will fail, but making sure it's not our last failure. And having resilience is knowing that each knockdown makes us stronger. In business, you need to develop your response to things like, we went with your competitor. We won't be renewing our agreement. The budget is frozen. What's your response? And I don't mean to the person telling you this, although you need that too. I mean how you respond internally. That's what will determine if you are building resilience or going backward. I will tell you how to build your resilience in part three. Same time tomorrow. Please subscribe and ring the bell on my profile so you'll notify when it comes out. See you then.